We can do this. We can get through this. Today's theme is tie dye, can you tell? Okay. Let me turn that down just a smidge. Okay, we can get through this. Today, you need to reread your story. Look at these. I gotta stand up. I gotta show you the whole thing. Because these are phenomenal pants. Look at these. Okay. Today's we're going to get in our storybooks, we're going to read Once Upon a Baby Brother again. Only this time you're going to take your summary and you're going to condense it. That means make it smaller. We're getting to the point where we can have a main idea at the very end. So we're working on two skills here. All right, so reread. Um, that's a little loud. <laughs> reread Once Upon a Baby Brother. Do your second summary. So take your first one, condense it down. And then do some Lexi units. You need to be getting in two Lexi units a day. Two a day. We need ten for the whole week. All right, so for math, you're going to take the pattern quilt block that you made yesterday. See mine? This is one of mine. And you're going to see, see this page? You're going to see if you made a symmetrical pattern. That means, is it the same whether you split it in half this way, this way, this way, whatever. Remember we talked lines of symmetry? So you're going to take your pattern block and you're going to see if you have lines of symmetry and tell me how many lines of symmetry you have. All right, I'll, I will post pictures of these also um, when I'm done. So that's for math. And then you will be watching a Steady Jams video on fractions because that's basically what we're doing. That's the concept we're working with, are fractions like halves and fourths. And then, and you can get on Dreambox when you're done with that. Work on some things in Dreambox. Um, with Dreambox, you will earn coins. The coins you can spend, which means on Fridays, you'll have another thing that's opened up where you can go into different areas and spend those coins for things. All right, science. You'll need to grab your green flip booklet. And you'll need to make sure those are cut out. And I'll put a picture of this on as well. And we're still talking about matter and how temperature changes matter. If I have an ice cube and I give heat to it, what happens to it? I have a liquid. I have a solid, put heat to it, I have a liquid. So we're still talking about how temperature changes matter. Have an awesome Wednesday.